Red Raiders softball looking to shake off two tough losses in their doubleheader yesterday, taking on Northern Colorado to finish up the Texas Tech Invitational Tournament. Getting it started early on is Shelby Johnson laying down a perfect bunt. Perez coming up to the plate next, and she would shoot one into the gap to bring Johnson in to give Tech the 1-0 lead in the first. Jumping to the fourth now, it's Elkins driving one up the middle, allowing two Red Raiders to come around to score to bump Tech's lead up to three. Tech would later add another run in the inning to go up 4-0. Northern Colorado not going away quietly though, getting all four runs back in the top of the fifth to tie this one up. The Red Raiders had a response of their own with Perez popping one up to shallow right, but a nice slide by Mikey Kinney would give the lead back to Tech. Then it was Elkins picking up her third RBI, lacing one down the left field line, giving Tech another insurance run and a 6-4 lead. Once again, though, the Bears continue to fight, tying it up with a two-run blast in the sixth, followed by another run in the seventh to take the lead. But the Red Raiders wouldn't be denied. After loading up the bases, Elkins came through with a walk-off single to bring the two winning runs around to score, capping off a career day for her, driving in five of Tech's eight runs, giving the Red Raiders an 8-7 to seven victory. I was pretty excited, but I mean, it wasn't just me. We had three batters in front of us that got the bases loaded, and then AP hit a hard, she got a hard shot, and that kind of set the tone for me. Um, it felt really good to come out with a win, especially um, since we're going to be playing this week at home. We needed some momentum to get us going, and I feel like it was good that we won our last game. Adjusting to how we like did at the beginning of the season, and then like we kind of had like a peak, and then we came down. We're just trying to come back up. Well, it's tough right now. It's tough because. You know, they, um, uh, uh, you know, they'll look at you sometimes like, what do we do, coach? And you got to be, be there all the time and keep filling their heads with good things, mainly with positive and encouraging stuff because we got some talented kids and what you don't want to or see kids get down because they have a couple of bad at-bats. And so um, uh, just keep them up, get ready for this, these next two weeks because we play a lot of ball games. Well, I mean, you know what? I, I, I take away that we got a chance to have a good club. We just got to be more consistent and and um, stay away from those uh, bad uh, egg laying innings that we've we've done. You know, we've we've played some good games and given up four or five runs in one inning, and you can't do that. You you got to stay focused, and when the pressure hits, you got to get tougher.